የየመጣች ነው ትንንሽ ልጆች ያሏቹ በአቤል እድሜ ወላጆች ያዟቹት ይዛቹዋቸው እናንተ ቁጭ ብሎ ከነሱ ጋር that would be wonderful all right yeah but gonna hi well let, let me have that let me where, where's the microphone okay oh, no hold on okay all right all right all right sami is sitting here too today huh is he they're coming ah we zaachu acho kuch baru wala awaqiyoch nitrinishochu orderly ndihon na madamat ndichilu malatno now who can tell me what this is what is it what is it what is it a milk bottle who uses this babies babies did you ever use one of those yes you did what is that milk milk bottle now did you keep it as a souvenir or no no you don't have it i bet your parents probably kept it just to remember you see one of the most exciting thing for parents are you listening to me now listen to me okay the most one of the most exciting things for parents is when they have a baby when a baby is born parents get very very happy okay and because they're happy you know what they do they start preparing in every way they buy things they uh, you know clothes for the baby preparing you know the uh, bassinet and the, th- the 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 bed that the baby is going to be sleeping on pajamas all kind of things you know they are excited so you go out and they prepare okay and yeah, toys okay some toys for a baby okay that would work too all right now they just not only prepare to buy things for them when they are a baby but then you know when they grow older they will make sure that they're going to be safe that they're going to be happy so they're going to protect them and do all that they can to help their children okay now today's story is about Moses who knows Moses what do you know about Moses tell me what do you know about Moses you can put the microphone on your mic his mother left him by the Nile his mother left him by the Nile that is very very true do you know why she did that it's because he was born at a very very bad time uh, in Egypt uh, the king was a very bad king okay uh, he forgot that the hebrew people who came to Egypt many 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 years ago uh, were welcomed there and he didn't know about Joseph okay so when he saw that the egypt the hebrew people were growing in number and they're becoming strong he was scared so you know what he started to do he made all the hebrew people to work so hard because he wanted to crush their spirit and that they do not rebel against him when that did not work guess what he did when that did not work guess what he did broke you listening to me good when that did not work he decided that the baby boys that are born should be killed now that's a very bad king right he wanted the boys to be killed the girls he let them live but the boys he wanted them to be killed because he was afraid so moses was born at that time so when the mother his mother saw that moses was just no ordinary child guess what she did she wanted to hide him and protect him from pharaoh so she took him she put him in a basket and by the river she she put, she placed him somewhere where there are tall grasses and guess what happened at that time pharaoh's daughter came to bath there he had to bath okay, to to wash okay and when she did that she saw the 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 the, the basket and she said there is something out there and she sent one of her uh, servants and the servant went and she and they found the baby they brought it to her and guess what she did she adopted that baby and became he became saved now that's what parents do they protect their children and they make sure that their children are taken care of when they grow up and that they will be really really well good parents do that so god protected moses through his mother pharaoh's daughter 
And guess what happened with Moses later on? He became one of the greatest men that ever lived. He started a nation. What a great man. Now I'm going to pray today for all of us. Can we pray? So that God would make you guys great people, right? All right, let's pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you this morning because you're a good God. You give us parents who care and who love us, parents who sacrifice and take risk to help us. They sacrifice so much for us. And most of all, Lord God, we thank you because you protect us from all kinds of evil. I pray for these children, Lord God, here today, that they are also no ordinary children because they are. God, I pray right now, Lord, that you bless them, keep them safe, and bless their parents as well. In Jesus' name we pray. What do we, what do we say? Amen. Amen. Wonderful. So now you go ahead to your classes. That you'll be learning more about Moses in your classrooms. Now, what do you think? I knew it. 